You just cannot. People keep dying. You can't get in your car and think it can't happen to you. I had a baby and I don't have her anymore. Also tonight, a grieving mother says the young woman who caused the crash that killed her baby girl is, quote, a selfish person who needs to pay for her crime. The driver admitted she was drunk and high when her SUV slammed into another car, killing that seven-month-old baby. Now she'll spend the maximum time in prison for her crime. And while nothing will bring back little Bailey, her heartbroken mother says justice has been served. News 4's Emily Gugamis is live at Erie County Court with more on the sentencing. Emily? It was a very emotional day in court as most were in tears and you could literally hear the sighs of relief as the judge read 24 year old Danielle Kellogg her sentence. The judgment of this court would be sentenced to an indeterminate sentence of imprisonment having a maximum of 15 years. <laughs> Danielle Kellogg pleaded guilty in March to first degree vehicular manslaughter for the crash that killed seven month old Bailey Dion. It was Kellogg's second drunk driving offense. Bailey's mother, Denise Hine, told the court what life has been like since that day on November 27th. And I did try crawling out of the car to get to her. And I was screaming for her, trying so hard. But no one would let me see her because they didn't want me to see how badly she was hurt. She spoke of her disgust that Kellogg did nothing to help that morning. How could she see my baby hanging out of the car that she tore in two pieces? And how could she hear me screaming, where's my baby, and not even come over? She spoke of how life is now a constant struggle. The situation is tearing mine and my fiance's relationship apart. We just become different people and it's so hard. I struggle to get out of bed most days as does he. But most of all, she spoke of her pain since the crash. When I run into people who don't know who I am and have been asking how many children I have, my heart crushes and I can't breathe because I say two. The first time I asked, I was asked this, and my daughter said, no, mommy, and pointed to the ceiling, and she said, what about Bailey? The second time I was asked this, I said, too. I left and got back in my car and cried and promised Bailey I would never say only two again. I'm a mommy of three. One is an angel now. It's pain even Danielle Kellogg acknowledged she can't take away. <laughs> In the bottom of my heart, I'm sorry. I never wanted to hurt anybody, never wanted to do it and cause any of this. 